I'm with my friend Rod Hairston, a pastor and former chaplain of the Baltimore Ravens uh, and author of the book Cover Her. I love this book. It's been like great coaching for a guy. Uh, but it seems like a lot of guys today, a lot of men, aren't getting married. And there's communities where there's very little marriage. Uh, what do you think is the key to reviving marriage and family in America, perhaps in communities where there just isn't enough marriage right now, it doesn't seem that relevant? Well, the commitment of marriage is, is daunting. It's overwhelming for a lot of men especially in communities where they have not been great models of marriage. Yeah. And so men shy away from it. But what I found, especially in my work in the NFL, when I began to disciple men and they began to get close to Christ, the whole idea of marriage raised very quickly in their mind. Mm. So I would tell guys oftentimes, I said, man, if you're 23, 24, 25 years old and you're not ready to get married, you must be disconnected from God. When you get connected to God, you're going to want a wife, and you're going to start looking for a good wife. And that's what I found happens. Tell me that story about a, a, a couple that was having trouble, and it was really significant what happened with a man. Absolutely. There was a couple I was working with in Baltimore. He was a player, and I uh, knew him from his rookie year, and he was totally disinterested in <laughs> marriage. Now, he had plenty of girlfriends, yeah. but he wasn't interested in marriage. And so I would challenge him regularly. After a few years, he finally began to get serious about his walk with God. And this young lady he was dating, he fell in love with. And so as he began to grow in his relationship with God, I began to coach him and her as a couple. And uh, they just celebrated their first year anniversary, awesome. first baby on the way. I think that's what I've been seeing too, that when we reach men with stepping up and we get to them about the identity in Christ yes. and the courage to be a real man and kind of what that blueprint is, all of a sudden, a healthy relationship with a woman makes so much more sense, and it's a vision that they want. So many times, the first step is reaching a man before you reach a marriage. Absolutely. You reach that man, you help him begin to discover who he really is, not what all the world says he is, not what his money says he is, mm. not what the cars say he is, who he really is, that he begins to understand what love is and what commitment is, and that he wants that because he knows it's good and right. So after we disciple that man, he's going to want to buy this book, Cover Her. I sure hope so. And get some good coaching Absolutely. on how to be a good man. Thanks so much, Rod. Great to be with you. My pleasure. Your My pleasure.